let's start with a shorter video, though. Let's start with a shorter video. Streamers get 55% of all ad revenue if you run three minutes or more an hour for your viewers, right? I can see exactly how much money each individual viewer generates based okay. on the per hour viewership they have on stream and the total amount of money that is made on that. So we can divide yeah. that by the number of hours. This lets me determine all of the factors required to find out if Turbo actually makes money. And it does. We know that it does because you are generating more cost there. You're paying Twitch more than you would otherwise make from the ad revenue that you would be watching which means okay. you're generating more money for twitch when you use turbo than you would if you were just watching ads and us getting ad revenue uh -oh. from that we're still making money off of it so it's not like it's ripping us off turbo makes twitch more money than you watching ads that's true i've seen some turbo watches i don't know how many people with turbo i have that actually watch me but i've been getting some sense from turbo just to be fair i can't really give like a gross estimate as to how well Turbo is working for that. Because I just don't have the numbers to compare. So I'll let Thor do the talking. Turbo's profit. It may not make more profit than subs bids, but options are profit. Yeah, no, it's it's an extra it's an extra option. If you have Turbo, Twitch is make more, making more money off Turbo than they would off of the ads you would have watched. Hands down. And we know that because we've done all the math on it. Turbo pays streamers? Yeah. So the way that Turbo works... Like, think about it this way. If I am running ads, which I do, mm -hmm. I get 55% of the ad revenue. Normally, you only yeah. get 30%. If you run three minutes, an hour of ads or more. If yes. you have Turbo, you don't see any ads. But it And most people run at least three minutes nowadays, an hour, because at three minutes, pre-roll ads get disabled. It pays you, pays the streamer, as if you did. So because I'm running ads, I get money from those ads. If you have Turbo, it counts as if you watched the ads. Great. Actually shows up in our analytics as a separate line, too. So we can see exactly how much we made off of Turbo. And you want to know something funny? When I started talking about Turbo, that amount went up. Because some of you realized, I don't want ads anywhere on Twitch. It's a really positive thing for the viewer. Surprisingly transparent from Twitch, I lobbied for it. A long time ago, I did a deep dive on analytics for ad revenue on Twitch. Because uh -huh. I found that the Ferret software stream was making double per minute per hour. of Or per minute per viewer over the main channel. So I actually reached out to Mike Minton, who's the chief monetization officer at Twitch. And I talked about this. I was like, hey, can you explain this discrepancy? Because I was like, what the hell is this? And he actually engaged with it. And we talked about it for a long time inside of this thread. And what it came down to was the ferret stream is more ad friendly because it's in the animals category. And the animals category is an ad friendly category. So advertisers are oh. more comfortable putting out advertisements in that category. That's it. That's oh. the reason. So when people were kind of okay. all pissed off at Twitch and yelling at Twitch and saying, why is my ad offer so low and his ad offer so big, it's because of the category and content that you provide. Your category and the content that you're providing isn't ad friendly. And if it's not, you I actually never thought about that. Like, we literally talked about that earlier with, like, the hot tubs and shit, with it being, like, monetized and shit. Same like the pool section, exactly. But I never, like, it never actually, like, properly made click in it. I wonder, like, what other categories are, like, profitable and what are non-profitable. Like, for example, I wonder how profitable just chatting is for, like, Twitch for advertisers. You're gonna get less ads. That's just how that works. The first thing that they changed as a result of this after they started putting this out was they made it so that now we can see exactly how much money we make off of Turbo. That wasn't in there before. After bringing this all up and complaining about this and showing all the information, they switched it over to have that because we couldn't see that Turbo was even benefiting streamers. And you know what happened? The grand majority of streamers went, wait a minute, I make money off Turbo? Because they didn't know. We knew because I look into all of the TOS and all the information that we get from Twitch, but the average streamer didn't know. So once they did know, they could tell their community and a lot more people started getting turbo which is better for twitch and hopefully makes them financially stable so that amazon doesn't shit on them one day right what's your all-time favorite game uh it's between outer wilds and secret of mana those are the two i had prime gaming with my prime membership and i never even realized until now that's funny you should be using that yeah it's just like cpm varies massively based on niche on youtube it's exactly the same exactly the same system you, your content is ad friendly or not ad friendly the cpm oh yeah that's true for example here's an example drama content gets less ad money compared to meme content. <laughs> Memes make so much more ad revenue than drama content. Who would have thought, right? Who would have thought? Like, holy shit, I had more views on 
like I have more views on drama content. Uh, like I compared some drama content I put out and I compared some meme content that I put out. The the specific drama content here in question had more views than that meme content, but it had less money made on it, which I was like, wait, what? But like thinking about it, it depends on what's advertiser friendly, right? We'll say the more age friendly the stream, the more ad friendly you are. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Very based on the country the ad is viewed in. Yes, it does. So there are different countries that have ads or don't have ads, right? Not every country is going to have advertisements. So oh, when you are streaming, too. it is based on the view. That's true too. For example, I remember <laughs> Slovenia. Exune lives in Slovenia, right? Slovenia, what the fuck is going on with my model? What the hell? I'm tweaking out again. Chat, what's happening? I love this. I love that I just tweak out in the middle of like trying to make a video. I love this. I love this so much. Mmm. Mmm. Slovenia mentioned. <laughs> yes, Exegon lives in Slovenia. And for a very long time, Spotify didn't have any ads on in, in Slovenia. So he was basically watching Spotify ad free. Just in the recent year, they added ads. What kind of ad they're going to get. It's based on the time, the category. It's based on their viewing habits. It's based on their country. It's based on all kinds of different factors because they're trying to target ads to the individual. So if the viewer is in a country where ads just don't exist, say for instance, right now, Russia, some of you guys are from Russia, you're not going to get ads. There's no advertisers that are advertising in Russia from anywhere else other than Russia right now. You're just not going to get ads. So because of that, you won't get them. But if you're in a country where there are ads, then it'll be like, okay, cool. What category is this? What time of day is it? What's the person's viewing habits? Let's feed them an ad that makes the most sense. Targeted ads are worth more money than untargeted ads. You're in Portugal and you don't get ads? Good example of that. Likely not being, you know, not being getting any ads based on your country there. You might get generalized ads for the whole region that you're in, but maybe not directly for you. PPC specialist here. Twitch has an incredibly high CPM, so we don't use it. Google still rules, unfortunately. Oh yeah, no, it's, that's true. I, I think the reason why is because it's live content. YouTube is going mm. to be lower cost. Twitch is probably going to be higher cost because of the live viewers. The biggest thing for me as a streamer, man, ads suck ass on live content. It's so awful. Ads yeah, on live content yeah, are just yeah, like a yeah, killer. Yeah, yeah, so 100%. Twitch did something to make this so that it's possible, like good for streamers to do it. They have these things called pre-rolls and pre-rolls are death for your channel. A pre-roll is the ad that plays when you first enter the channel and then it never plays again. It's like when you first enter. When you enter a channel and you get eight ads and like you've never seen that streamer you're before, just you just again. leave. Were fed you just leave. Dollars. So you just leave. There's no reason to stay because you're yeah. like, dude, I've never seen this streamer before. What the hell would I Why watch would ads I to stay? watch? Screw that. I bounce. You change the channel. If you run ads yep. and you run three minutes of ads per hour, like I've been talking about, not only do they change your rate from 30% of the ad revenue to 55%, but they kill pre-rolls. There's no pre-rolls. When I did this, we went from our normal rate of followers to six to seven times that rate. And it stays that way because there's no barrier to entry. You gain six to seven times as many followers when you don't have pre-rolls. Pre-rolls are a mess, pre dude. Suck. It is such a big deal for every streamer to run ads and no longer have pre-rolls. It's better for the platform. It's better for you. And as long as you pause during ads like I do, it's better for your community too. Nobody loses if you do this shit. If you do it correctly. There's a reason so many people, especially if they can't get turbo or channels, subs or whatever reason, try to use ad blockers. That's fair, yeah. I said if you can't and you want to use an ad blocker, use an ad blocker instead. I don't care. Use an ad blocker. I'm fine with it. I'm fine with it, man. I, I don't care. Just do it. Because ads, ads in the middle of, ads in the middle of a live stream while you are actively having a conversation is, bro, <laughs> like imagine you, <laughs> imagine you're on Discord, right? Imagine you're on Discord and 
you talk to a friend and like everyone's talking to that friend but suddenly you just get deafened you get deafened and muted and you can't be part of the conversation anymore but you can uh no 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 like you get half deafened like you can still hear the other people reacting to the other person you can still hear people reacting to the person but you can't interact with anyone uh it, it's uh that's so dumb that's so dumb but also with the ad blockers um, as said, my ad blocker works for me, but for some reason it doesn't work for other people. I don't know why. I don't know how. It just is how it is. Uh, what's not better to have ads on and safer because it's not live, but who really watches VODs? Bro, no one watches VODs. Sorry. 1% watch VODs. People don't go and watch VODs. You can see them in Clippers watch VODs. Okay, but that would mean... That would mean you need Clippers on your channel. Skill issue, to be honest. What the fuck do you mean, skill issue? Uh, skill issue on what, man? I don't like watching VODs because I don't... I, because I want to be able to interact with the stream. There. Yeah. I'll stop watching what's then. <laughs> okay, stop watching what's then. Like. <laughs> if you want to watch what's, sure, watch what's. But it's like the 1%. It's less than 1% of people that actually do watch what's, you know? I believe that what should at least be an option. Okay, actually, I'm gonna say something. Uh, and I don't know how, right? I have made ad money on days that I wasn't streaming. I've made ad money on days I was not live. So, I would guess that some wads do have ads. You know? Because how the fuck do I make ad money otherwise? Like, what I- Literally what I guessed was someone went to watch the VOD. When I saw that I made a handful of cents of ad money on that day. It didn't make sense to me otherwise. Like, how the hell would I make ad money when I'm not live? Know what I mean? Like here, I'm, I'm gonna pull up my analytics right now. I'm gonna look into my analytics. Like, I'm not gonna show them on stream. So then if we view your old words, it still gave you the ad money. Well, that's good, since I missed some lives. I believe so. I do believe so. Um, Where do I see it? On the earnings? Here, four cents. Up, up, up. Let's find a day where I wasn't live. Up, up, up. Yeah, this is a day I wasn't live. 60 cents on ads. How? Where, where are those 60 cents coming from? Here, yeah, 4 cents. I don't know why 60 cents. That's crazy, to be honest. That's a, a lot of ad views. Like, what? Something must have been going on on that day. But here, four cents. And I was alive. Here's another day. Three cents. Three cents again. I was alive. Yeah, I believe Twitch wants to serve ads. I'm not 100% sure of it, but yeah. The 60 cents day may have been from when you were pushed to the front page. No, it wasn't. It was not. It was way before that. I can see what days it is. I can see from what day it is. And no, I didn't get extra ad revenue for the front page promotion. Because people that watched me on the front page 
promotion. They didn't get the ads. They saw me on the front page. <laughs> they don't get ads on the front page. Not Twitch, but should be off it on like YouTube. It has a better video player and you make way more ad revenue. That would require you to actually have a monetized watch channel. I do have a watch channel, if you didn't know, but I barely get any views on it and I do not keep up to date with it either. Because I'm one person. I'm a one woman operation. <laughs> I'm a one woman operation, so you sue me. I can't get all the bots out. My bad. <laughs> My fucking bad, chat. Every Twitch what I have watched had ads. Well, there you go. There you go. <laughs>